You dodge these. Luxio, you're him. He was not him. Hit that sh baby! Come on, Sun Tzu! You're the GOAT! Monkey! <laughs> Monkey time. Uh, check out this box. It's horrible. Mostly because we lost this GMO f***ing Dreadnought. Lost this guy to an unfortunate crit and this to me playing like an asshole. You know, I was sad about the wipe and then I thought about it a little bit and then I realized this game's really f***ing fun and I am on no timer to beat this. It doesn't matter how long it takes. I can sit here all day playing this, having fun, streaming, hanging out with my friends. We're gonna get there eventually. You know, last year when I was streaming sometimes, when I was doing like, Infinite Fusion or something, it was like, F dude, I gotta beat this game because I need a video for it, and it's like, and then when it'd be, when it get close or I'd wipe or something, I'd be like, F But now it doesn't matter. I have fun playing this game. I can take a million attempts, who the f cares? Okay, let's hope for the best forest encounter, which I believe will be Eldegoss. I'm not a Carnivine hater. I accept my stage issued Carnivine on the monkey run. I don't give a sh so 30% Carnivine, 20% Shroomish. I think we're two for two with Shroomish on this route. Steeny, Chikorita, Bellsprout, Gossiflor, Big P, Weep and Bell, Deerling. The goat here is obviously Gossiflor, but we'll just take what we get. Yep, expected result. Said I'd accept it, I said I'd take it. You can take me at my word. All right, nickname for this little guy. Hell yeah. Shout out to my boy. What a perfect name. Quiet nature, baby. Let's f***ing go. Look at this f***ing dog shit ass Carnivine. Oh my god. <laughs> Dude, not having Dreadnought is so bad for this split, actually. Do you mean a second? I mean, it, it was like, initially it was the only way that I saw to beat Brawly or beat the Combuskin, but I think if I had thought about it a little bit more, I probably could have found a better line. I fast kill on this. This is Ninjas Dual Wing Beat, which I don't have a switch in for. <laughs> I'd have to go Magnemite. Oh, Magnemite actually does something, that's crazy. Monkey time! Oh yeah, he Shadow Sneaks anyway, true. God, Magnemite already taken names. This is actually a guaranteed kill. can safely go back here, right? Because there's no way he aerial aces here, and then I just outspeed and kill always, I'm not missing anything. Unless I have misclicked here, I guess. Cool. Has the game been beaten with every starter? Is there a Torterra win? I think there, there must be, right? Okay, Larvesta, Eviolite. No fucking rock types. This is so AIDS, man. I mean, you still win with Bubble Beam Seedra, right? So the only thing is, do I want Seedra for this instead? Because how the f*** do I beat this Vibrava otherwise? Oh wait, Vivalon just walls this, right? Or Mask, yeah. My bad, my bad. I enjoyed Pokemon X and Y. It's okay to be wrong. Sometimes it's just okay to be wrong. Rare Poison Point proc. What move is this? Signal Beam or Magical Wave. What did I say I would beat the Swift? Does it matter? I think I should do it with Mask. Okay, I could stay in. Because it doesn't fing do anything to me. Get some Mask Rain Frags. Um, yeah, no reason not to, right? Sorry. 33 off a of breaking swipe crit. Okay, do I stay in here? It's got bright powder, I kind of forgot about that. <laughs> Shadow sneak crit is 28. Just don't miss. Cool. Masquerade, kind of a baller. Yeah, let's try to get a scary face off. Don't flinch. Nice. Headbutt crit on me is 42. 
Nice, good crit. We're gaming. I'm out of crit range right now. Always faster, always kill. Okay, so this is fire or ice fang. Monkey time. Monkey. God, watch my boy pop off. Monkey. All right, that fight was very easy. I don't really have a solid plan for this, but I think this should be fun. We do something like bug bite the citrus, sludge this guy. Tank a Dazzling Gleam, because Carnivine's a fucking monster. Ooh, that's not good. That's not a good start at all. Eat this berry. And I was thinking maybe I Acid Spray here now? Sludge here, because if he helping, if he follow me, is the sludge kills him before the acid spray. Carnivine a decent encounter. Don't want to talk about it. It's actually it's a, it's not that terrible. I don't know if that was the right move, to be honest, but I know I can kill this after. Should be Abra always Psybeam into exactly Rosa Raid, unless this can kill Carnivine. No, never. Yeah, it's always Psybeam into Rosalia. Okay. So I can either kill the Abra with Bug Bite, or I could kill the Dead Den. The problem is this is Gleam again. My switch into the Psybeam here is actually kind of cooked. I think I have to go Magnemite on the Roselia slot, which is like negative tempo. I think I shouldn't have brought Mighty Anna. Okay, I think... The thing is, I think I killed the Dead Den. I'm pretty sure this is correct. I think my position looks better this way the next turn well okay can at minus two can mag can magnemite killed it then from this HP well, it doesn't look like it okay so this is always targeting magnemite at least so carnivine's fine here So fun fact, Carnivine can actually want to KO both of these Pokemon, but it's too low because we have Hidden Power Fire for this, but... Okay, what do I do? 26 HP. I mean, this is always Gleam, but... 
We have to switch Carnivine, that's for sure. Does Abra always target Carnivine? No. It doesn't actually see a kill currently. I have to switch. I think it's Shockwave on Abra. Okay, and if it's into this... Uh, okay, so now I can go... What is this click? It would be Iron Head. I think I go Mighty Yana now. <sighs> I'm actually going to have a really hard time killing this Togi now that I think about it. Oh, we're in a little bit of trouble, boys. Well, let's figure this out. Abra has a Lumberry. I guess I could go with Leo Unnerve, but... Cybeam to Mighty, please. Nice. Okay. Now what? My Yana's gonna die if it gets double targeted. And I think so is... No, Magnemite is fine. Magnemite is super safe. Although it can die if it gets crit by this, I think. I think I switch Mighty Yana. Probably for Litleo. The problem is if it's Zing Zap into the Mighty Yana slot. That's fine. And this just kills here. How scary is double target Magnemite? I still have my berry, right? It's not scary at all. I forgot about that, but I think it's fine. Yeah, this is okay. Crit on Leo. Okay, we're fine. I think we're chilling. I think we're chilling. Now it's just you. Zing Zap crit for 45. Okay. If we get flinched, we're still kind of fucked. Because I have like no way to kill this Toga tomorrow. I think Magneto Magnemite is going to stay in here. And just Sonic Boom. Because we're never dead to Zing Zap crit, crit with him either. We just double attack. This is not going to kill though. Oh yeah, he's intimidated too, actually. Ooh, that's actually a lot of damage. This might kill? Oh, we flinched, okay. Well, this is still safe. Um, are we dead to crit now with you? I think so, right? Nope, Sing's up, crit is 18 max. This is always safe, no matter what. Ooh, another flinch. This guy's fragging out. Does this kill? Oh my god, bro. <laughs> Come on. Dude, Magnemite is racking up kills right now. Um, I just go Mighty Yana. We could get flinched here again, by the way. Bro got a flinch every turn. This is insane, bro. <laughs> he target, dude. <laughs> okay, well, now I have to account for crit on Mighty Yana plus, um, oh no, this isn't Iron Barbs. Oh, I totally should've just brought Abe. Oh, Magnemite's still not dead to crit, actually. It's actually free for the goat, I think. Wait, no, he's totally dead to crit, okay. The problem is it's, no, it's never Iron Head, right? He's minus two, maybe there's overlap. Nope, okay. So I should be able to just go Carnivine, I think. All right, we finally have it, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Easy, free, not even close, wasn't even worried. 
Another riskless fight, boys. That was a very unlikely kill. Good job, Masquerine. Alright, made it to Rust, bro. Not gonna make it much further than this, though. Okay, so we get this encounter, then we'll theorycraft Roxanne a little bit, think about if we want Toga tomorrow and stuff. Uh, the best possible result for Roxanne here is getting a Tyroke that turns into Hitmonlee. I think uh, Makuhita's pretty good for a Roxanne too, right? That's about it. Pretty sure. I don't think you can get anything else that's helpful. Monkey time! Okay. Pause champ. Now, is this person is this person a historical figure? I think I would say who gives a shit. I know somebody on the Patreon, I can't find it right now. Submitted messy. Surely this will give us the hitmon Lee. Alright, check him out. Naughty. That's what the f I'm talking about. That's what the f I'm talking about, baby. That's what the f I'm talking about, baby! Four speed is unfortunate, but this is, um... This is gonna be Hitmonlee. Messi! I can't, I can't do a football announcer. I don't know what they, what they say. I don't know what they do. There he is, boys. Ankara Messi. So I think what we do now is we cook a rock sand without any other encounters and see what we can get. Okay, so what you're telling me... I'm never fishing here. Because right now I sometimes beat this with four mons. So I can actually just sack whatever I want to Zygarde. And have like Seedra in the back for backup because it can it technically deals with a lot of shit, right? I don't have to. Okay, so I I have a complete. Wait, this is the fucking freest shit ever as long as I use a candy, which means I have to get the candy, which is like not actually that easy. <laughs> Especially, dude, how the f do I beat Raticate? Ape does beat the rat, I guess. All right. Luckily, it's not the entire thing back to back. <laughs> All right, monkey time, monkey. Monkey. Yeah, Dreadnought would have been pretty f useful, I'm not gonna lie. Okay. It's always boosted retaliate. Monkey. Mock punch does not kill there, no. I I tried with the uh, scaled attack, it also doesn't kill. It's like a range. Um, okay. Uh, what was the f***ing play? I think I go th Do I go through my Diana or something? No, the only way- The only reason to pivot is to get a seed bomb, which I think is technically correct. Let's see, so this was... Guaranteed Night Slash. I could go through Seedra. Making my Pidgeotto matchup weaker. Um, or I could go hard Vivalon. The only problem with Vivalon is that if this is crit, low roll into crit, which is, it sounds like fiction, but it's slash and night slash, um, we would lose Vivalon. So let me evaluate my Pidgeotto matchup one more time here. I think we're gonna be okay. I can still do the pivot and try to do this with Masquerade instead. Ah, f yeah, we'll just adapt. Oh wait, I'm Silver Powder. Yeah. Mm, okay, we'll figure it out. Just don't crit and we're fine. See, not even worried. Okay. So this is heat wave. This is like a random move. 
Hard Cedra or Hard Mighty Yana first? The Intimidate doesn't matter, this is a physical attacker. Um, let's go Cedra first, because it reduces the chance of Heat Wave Burn on the Mighty Yana switch in. Okay, worst possible move, unfortunately. Never did air slash crit. So, hit a fat Aurora Beam. We're speed tied, by the way. Don't flinch me. This is annoying. Okay. So, what do I do now? I mean, I could pivot through Magnet. Yeah, it doesn't really make sense. I think I have to just go hard Mighty Yenna. Worst case, Mask Rain can also finish this off, actually. We're not actually that cooked, to be honest. Our slash crit hits for 37 on the max. Let's not get flinched now. That would be f***ing dope. And I always go for this para over the freeze. It doesn't matter as a Lumberry. Don't do it. Not dead to crit now, which is huge. Just don't flinch. Nice. Okay. Random move. We can just go Masquerade no matter what move this is. We always live a crit and then we always outspeed and we always kill. Riskless. Boomless. Bitchless. This is the slowest Roxanne split you've ever seen. Alright, now for the hard part, boys. So we have to fight the next two fights back to back if we want that rare candy. The only way I have to deal with Gyarados is I need to... switch in Carnivine. Because, like, I need things with more than 70 HP. Okay, this would also work technically, but it doesn't do enough damage. Mighty Anna's part of this. Okay. I just know that this is what I need to beat, so... Let's look at the double, because this shit is... So even Miracle Seed Magical Leaf doesn't quite always kill it, very unfortunately. We could do Fake Out plus that, but then this guy just frags out. Yeah, the fact that this can Fake Out is just completely f***ing disgusting. Let's say we lead Vivalon and we just... We do we do f***ing attempt two strats. You could pre-damage to be dead to Fake Out, right? I think that works. I th I'm not 100% I'm not sure if Fake Out is just always super discouraged on... um. Like, does Shield Dust still draw fast kills from from Fake Out? I'm not actually sure how it works. No, Fake Out is just regular. Da fake Out is a regular damaging move. It's just a special case that if you're not Shield Dust or Inner Focus, then it's turn. It's first turn. It's plus nine. <laughs> so stupid to go for this over just f***ing fishing. Why am I doing this, man? All right, so we want this candy because I'm too stubborn to fish. So I gotta do these back to back, and uh, before raising my level cap, so this is... This is the worst thing you've ever seen in your life. So I think this should work. So we should be able... To fake out. Into... Double kick. First kick takes off the chopple, second kick kills. <sighs> You're the goat, Messi. All right, this Gyarados only has Dragon Rage. So we're gonna go to this. I could hit with Lee, but it doesn't actually do anything. Cause I need to do a certain amount of damage. 
Orenberry gets us out of range for another Dragon Rage, so we can Leaf Tornado. And now we can go here. Thunderfang should always kill avoiding the Citrus Berry. You're the goat. Okay. That was the easy part. This is the completely impossible part. So we can't leave the route if we want the potion. Or the, the candy, rather. All right, Messi, time to clutch up, buddy. This is so bad. I don't know why I'm doing this, man. I, I don't know. All right, so usually Perugly shouldn't be able to fake out um, Vivalon because it's shield dust, but because we're actually dead to it, we can do it. Messi has to clutch up here, he has to not minimum roll these double kicks. No icy wind, please. Why? Oh well, I guess we lose. <laughs> ah, unlucky. The documentation says if the AI I'm on first Mon's first turn out and not targeting shield dust in her focus mon plus nine. I didn't realize there was a... Well, that's unfortunately truck. Good luck. That's fine. Still gotta hit this range though. Do it. Messy, 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 messy! Messy, 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 messy! Okay. In it, in it. Okay, Hitmonlee never did the ice punch. C drop, unfortunately, never fing dead to anything. Oh no. I can't go. Here's to monk three baby pants, stay brown boys. Well, it's, 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 it's Brian on C draw, obviously, but. Hold on, what is it from, from this exactly? It's grass, not Brian or water plush. The problem is I gave the fing miracle seed to Carnivine. And the Sneasel is clicking knock off if it's targeting Seedra. I think it's Mighty Yenna. It's the only it's the only other option. I'm not losing my Miracle Seed. I have to do this exactly. Um, the issue is I think Mighty Yenna is just dead. He needs to crit one of the two. And he needs to click Water Pledge. This is inner focus, right? No. That's unfortunate. That's quite unfortunate. That is quite unfortunate. That is... Looks like we're going to the truck. Why did I do this, man? <laughs> I could have just fished. I can never win. It's just over. I think I just wipe, right? Um... Yeah, it doesn't matter. I didn't know about the fake out thing, to be fair. I just didn't know that.
I can't believe I didn't know that after all of attempt two. Poison point. Doesn't matter. Ah, uh, cool. Doesn't even kill, probably, right? Yeah. Alrighty. <clears throat> so, fun fact all my three wipes were to a double battle so far. Well, I know, I guess the one was actually fought as a single. Okay, so AI just doesn't fake out shield dust mons, yeah? Cause all the all the documents says if it's if it's the AI's first turn out and not targeting shield dust plus nine. But it should have still seen fast kill on Vivalon for for um plus ten plus twelve. That's why I didn't understand that. Fifty fifty range, you're the goat. Ah, it sucks. I could have just gone for Roxanne. I could have just fished, but this seemed cool. I don't know, man. I wanted to do it. Obviously, if I'd known about this interaction, I would have gone for it, so it's okay. No harm done. All right. Yeah, let's see what we would have gotten, I guess. Okay, we would have gotten it. Unlucky! Go next. First early game wipe. 